Hey guys, Troy here, and today I'm going to be doing a video on uh, Scrap Metal. Uh, finally got an update on him. He actually looks pretty good. And as you can see, the last two videos I've been uh, using my desk area, and I think I'm going to stick with that. So, unfortunately, my Troy sign won't fit up here. But that's okay. So here we have the new and, gosh, improved, um, gosh, I forgot his name, uh, Scrap Metal. And as you can see, I've done quite a bit on him. Uh, he's the, basically the same thing. He's just got some panels strip put on him to make his... I guess you could say his robot mode looked a little better. Uh, but besides that, it's just basically the same. You got these taillights. The uh, turn signals back here. Here are the taillights, if you can see them. Um, on the front, he doesn't really have much detail except for windshield. He's got his wheels here. As you can see, I put the this 1x6 there. Unfortunately, he's got visible hand syndrome, but oh well. If you wondered, he got he has he got huh, he has a uh, visible feet syndrome, but he doesn't have visible head head syndrome. Uh, so unfortunately, he's got some robo kibbles showing. Yes, I said robo kibble, and yeah, but besides that, he he's just basically in. Armored truck. Just basically advanced from what he was. And so let's get down to comparison. So, of course, here he is with a minifigure. About the same height. Yeah, so there's that. Get him out of the way. Just show him with his twin brother, Scrap Heap. Get him in there. So, Scrap Heap's just slightly taller, just like in the older version. And, because I have him on my desk, here he is with a slightly updated version of Hailstorm. Hail, yeah, Hailstorm. And, I need to do an, uh, an update video on this guy, because, because I need to. Um, so, get that out of the way. Uh, I don't make weapons for these guys, but, of course, you can, I'll take Hailstorm's he new head, which is kind of exposed, but oh well. So, we'll just take this thing and plug it into here. I guess you could say you could plug it into the exhaust pipe. And there he is, shooting... Molten Lava, or Hailstorm's Head. You didn't hear nothing. Um. <coughs> so, there we have that. So, let's get down to Transformation. But, of course, I forgot the main show. And that's a nice glass of lemon. Just put that off to the side. <laughs> um, so... Let's get down to Transformation. It's basically the same thing, but it's... Got, it's got some different parts to it. So, I'm going to start off with the arms. Obviously, you could guess that. So, just bring them down. And then... Basically, you're doing that. And then flip them up. Fortunately, this guy's got a little bit of sag on that. Then flip out uh, these things. And these can be... Easily his uh, robo guns, just like that. Uh, so you're going to flip these up. Um, so we're going to start off with an arm. What you're going to do is you're going to flip this up like that, rotate the hand, and Rotate this section, it's on a jumper plate. Rotate this little 
piece right there. Fold down his arm. And there you have an arm done. Um, so, do the same thing on the other side. Rotate that. Bring down the hand. Rotate, uh, this section. And bring it down. Like that. And there you have his arms done. So then you're going to take these, this section right there. Right, both of them. Oh, I'm tongue-tied today. <laughs> so, here we have that, and then you're going to take these bits right here, just fold these down as far as you can do that, and then what you're going to do is you're going to uh, rotate this up on this uh, joint right there, do the same thing on the other side, and... What I find it the best to do is take these off, but I'm going to try not to do that um, so for the legs. Uh, so what you want to do is you're going to rotate this down. This is the same thing as the older version. And then you're just going to rotate that around. Uh, you're going to basically bend his knee. Except for his knee is up further. So you're going to break his ankle. Well, he's got some ankle tilt. Uh, so there's that. And you're going to rotate this section. Uh, actually, you're going to rotate it the other way. And then you're going to stop halfway. Rotate this up. And then just slide it down. Just like that. Hoping you guys can see this. And then you're going to... Rotate it the rest of the rest of the way. Like I said, I'm tongue-tied today. Um, and then rotate this plate. And then press it up. Just like that. And then you're going to lift it up all the way. Then just rotate this hinge just like that. Second verse, same as the first. I got that from MGO. If you haven't noticed, but anyway, um, so rotate that down, rotate the foot, uh, rotate the, I guess the robo gun, you could say, uh, ankle tilt, rotate, slide, bring up, rotate, and slide. And there you... Oh, one more thing. Rotate and rotate. And there you've got his legs. Finally done. Finally. It's a, quite a bit of a transformation. And finally, you're going to just going to... You're going to take this section, flip it all the way onto his back. And I like how this is done. I like how his windshield... Uh, it just forms into his back. Make sure his civilians are safe. Then make sure to fold this hinge down too. And then just fold this. Fold, eh, this part always breaks. But then fold. Hang on. Actually you're going to rotate these black cheese slopes around. You don't have to do that. But I just prefer to just to. Add on to the transformation. Also add on to the robo, rob, robot look. And then just fold this down. And then just fold up the taillight section just like that. And there you've got his nice little backpack going on. Uh, so just fold his head down. Just like that. And get his arms positioned. And there is scrap metal. Get him into it. Ah. There is scrap metal in his robot mode. And I like this guy a lot. This is one of my favorite scrappy transformers. Which I have... Quite a bit, unfortunately, for example. 
I have Weed Whacker. I have, of course, Scrap Heap. And, yeah. So, there he is. And he looks really good, in my opinion. He's got lights around him, which goes with the dark of the moon, kind of. Um, yeah, pretty much that's basically it for him. Uh, so, just rotate him around. He does, he does have some articulation, quite a bit, actually. So, just give him a quick 360. I like how his taillights end up on his legs. I also like how his wheels end up on his arms, instead of on his legs, uh, compared to a Scrap Heap. I also like that he has these things here. Some people won't like that. I don't care. And you can just flip these forward and kind of just collapse them on his on his uh, top of the arm. Right. Eh, forget it. Uh, but he has that he can do, but... Honestly, that's kind of chunky, so I just like to leave it off to the sides. It looks a little bit better. So, let's get on to comparisons. So, here, he, uh, here is Scrap Metal with a minifigure. And it seems like he grew quite a bit. Um, here he is with, uh, his twin brother, well, not his twin brother, but pretty close. Here he is with Scrap Heap, just get him, there we go, and there's that, and just put him off to the side, and make sure Hailstorm's all good. Here he is with the upgraded Hailstorm. And as you can see, this part just forms his head, but that's a different story. I'll make a video on that, hopefully. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to make a tutorial. I was going to make a tutorial for this a while ago, but I didn't, so forgive me on that. And so, yeah, a new thing I'm going to do is articulation. So, he's got up and down movement. Well, up and down movement, kind of. He's got a rotation at the head. Up and down at the shoulders. Bends at the elbow. He's got some hand movement right there. Uh, rotates forward and backward. Uh, back about that much. Forward about that much. So, yeah. Uh, he's got a bend at the knee. And he can go back all the way due to the transformation. Uh, he's got some ankle tilt. And he can move his foot. And yeah, that's about it. So, let me guys let... Ah, gosh. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Uh, let me know if you have any ideas on a Transformer I could possibly review. As in Lego Transformer, of course. But see you guys later.